So the president uh, announced this on Saturday. It's been long rumored that John Kelly was going to leave as the president's chief of staff. The two men uh, have developed an acrimonious relationship over the year uh, that Kelly has been in the job as chief of staff at the White House. The president, though, going out of his way on Saturday to suggest this was an amicable departure and also to suggest that he had a successor waiting in the wings. Here's what the president said. John Kelly will be leaving. We got, I don't know if I can say retiring, but he's a great guy. Uh, John Kelly will be leaving uh, at the end of the year. We'll be announcing who will be taking John's place. It might be on an interim basis. I'll be announcing that over the next day or two. But John will be leaving at the end of the year. He's been with me almost two years now, as you know, between the two positions. So everyone assumed it was Nick Ayers, but yesterday Nick Ayers tweeted this, suggesting that he's leaving the White House. After all, he is the vice president's chief of staff. He said, thank you, uh, at real Donald Trump and at VP and my great colleagues for the honor to serve our nation at the White House. I will be departing at the end of the year, but we'll work with the Make America Great Again team to advance the cause, hashtag Georgia, that's his home state, to which he will be returning. The president then responding on Twitter himself, <clears throat> the president tweeting out this, I am in the process of interviewing some really great people for the position of White House Chief of Staff. Fake news has been saying with certainty it was Nick Ayers, a spectacular person who will always be with our Make America Great Again agenda. I'll be making a decision soon. So who's on the list? Here's our best guess, but this is uh, relatively uh, a guess. Uh, Treasury Secretary Mnuchin, uh, Mick Mulvaney, the Budget Director, Lighthizer, the Trade Representative, Congressman Meadows of North Carolina. He's the conservative leader of the Freedom Caucus. All of those are names that have been mentioned, but there was so much focus on Nick Ayers, the vice president's chief of staff, taking this job uh, that now sort of all of official Washington a little bit surprised here trying to figure out who might be in line for that job. The president says that John Kelly is going to be leaving by the end of the year. So that gives him just a couple of weeks to figure this one out, Joe.